The second planet from Sun, Venus, looks beautiful. It looks like a white marble full of clouds. It was named after the Roman goddess, also by the same name, Venus. She was the goddess of love and beauty. For decades or even for centuries, men thought Venus is an amazing place to live in. Until our astronomers found out that Venus is a burning hot planet. The planet is so hot, the water, when it falls down from the sky, it evaporates before it lands on the ground. And then it evaporates again and forms clouds. So it's a perpetual motion of rain pouring everywhere but never reaches the ground. That's how burning hot Venus is. And do you know what is the most prominent gas in Venus? Carbon dioxide. Yes. It's an amazing case or it's an extreme case of global warming. What happens to a planet when there is too much carbon dioxide? Of course, we may not really go there. Earth is probably going to be only a few more degrees hotter than today. But what will happen? Today's estimate is there could be extreme weathers. It could be scorching heat in summer. There could be more floods. A few cities near the shore could probably go underwater, even Hong Kong. But is that all? We don't know yet. If we are going to be very certain about what is going to be the actual disaster of global warming, it could be too late. So please start acting now. We may not be able to stop everything, but we could slow things down. We don't have to deliver 100% of what we or every company or the countries in the world promise now. All we have to do is take one little step towards a more sustainable earth. Thank you.